Yeah, buzz bait. Like it. Like it. Oh, he came off. I like it when it happens like that, but that was a good bite. Let me show you what I've done here. This is a regular buzz bait with a neat little twist to it. That's a Strike King Tour Grade, 3 8 ounce buzz bait, and I've taken a Z2 and put behind it. Gives it a whole different look. It gives it a look more like a minnow instead of a bulky skirt hanging there. They can really hone in on it, and that one blasted it really, really well. Let's see if I can get back and get his brother. That's a one-two twist on it. I've got another little secret I'll show you in just a second. Golly, that was a good bite. He did not like that buzz bait over his head. Just once. That's a good one. That's a good one. Come here, big boy. Yeah, he's not liking that buzz bait. Get up in here. All right. Buzz bait. A tour grade with a twist. And boy, did he get it. Now that doesn't look like your average buzz bait. And that's just a good, nice two and a half pound keeper. And he smoked that. It's bare bones with that Z tube on the back of it. But it's a great way to catch them when they're feeding on those little small minnows or you're fishing on a pressured lake. Good fish. Let me show you my other little trick I've got right here too. Here's another little Strike King buzz bait. This is the tri wing, triple wing buzz bait. And this is one of my favorites. I've done this for years with little buzz baits, put grubs on the back of them. And you can see it makes the whole profile even smaller. The thing I like about this buzz bait with the triple wing, when I retrieve it extremely slow, it plop, 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 plop. It's a real loud buzz bait to be that small. But when I speed it up and get that blade moving a little faster, it's real quiet. It has a real white, real purring sound to it. My little triple wing, let's see if we can go back behind the tour grade and get another bite. <laughs> 